Some nights I stay up casting in my To be an admiral player means everything to me. I'm a part of a family. I have somewhere to go and some, somewhere I'm wanted. It's a sense of family. It's like being a part of a big family. Everybody really just gets along with each other. I, I just love being here every day. It means that you're part of a family. It means that you're part of something special. I'm really glad that I was welcomed in so easily. Being part of Admiral Players, I had friends that were seniors in the building. And when you're in this club, it doesn't matter what grade you're in, how old you are, what you look like, anything. It's the capability of expressing yourself through something that you love. Because there's so many parts of theater that it's much more about being there and being a part of it. There's people around you who fit in with you and who appreciate you and who love you. It means gaining knowledge and improving in dancing and singing and acting. I've learned a lot of new techniques. Well, I wasn't really a dancer before I started Admiral Players, but I'm a lot better now that I've been in it. It means discipline and like coming together with everyone because we have to work together and put on a show. To be an Admiral Player means to create. It means a whole lot because when I was younger I used to go see the Admiral Player shows and I used to idolize everyone on stage. It's being part of something remarkable with some truly remarkable people. This is Arlington, like this is bigger, this is Admiral Players like acting, this is bigger than anything that I've ever been a part of. What will you miss most about the Admiral Player? Really hard Probably miss all the new people I met. I'm gonna miss all the friends that I've made this year and last year. I miss the people. The friends that I've made, most definitely. I'll definitely miss people a lot. All my friends. All the relationships I've formed. Everything. Everyone. Miss Combs a lot. Miss Combs, she's just awesome. I'll miss Mrs. Combs and all the all the faculty and all the the people. That's that's what I'll miss most. I miss the cast, the crew, and the faculty advisors because they all defined my whole entire high school experience. Sitting in the black box, or the dressing room, or the auditorium, not even doing anything, just feeling like I have a place in this school, and it's right here. I'm gonna miss the thrill of being on stage with some of the most talented people on earth. The constant ability to grow and learn as a performer. It's really hard to go away and think to yourself, you're never gonna get to be in a show with these people in this type of a setting ever again. Do you have a favorite moment? I have two. The first one I would say is when I got to see my older sister, Jessica, be elected president of the Animal Players. And when my younger sister, Victoria, did her first Animal Players audition, which I heard clearly through the walls of the Black Box Theater. Well, I, I probably wouldn't have been in this if Zach didn't pester me in health class to come into West Side Story. And I'm loving him for it. <laughs> Mic checks because people just come up with things that are so funny. There's that time that Nick, he was supposed to say beat it, but instead he said drop it. So I was laughing so hard I couldn't even get my line out. I just laughed and walked off. Learning the girls' part to cool. My freshman year, the first show I ever did, Once Upon a Mattress, there was a dance number called The Spanish Panic. And during a rehearsal for that, in the dance studio, I Spanish panicked a little bit too much. And I almost fainted. The night that my dress did not come off during Guys and Dolls, and uh, one parent went up to another parent and said, did she not take off her dress for religious reasons? You learn so many life lessons. I've learned 10 times the things that I think I would have learned anywhere else. I jotted them down. <laughs> Cherish the moments you had in the Admiral Players and learn something at every rehearsal and don't be afraid to take, take some risks. Never stop learning and never stop striving for greatness. You should love what you do. No matter what anyone else says, if you love it, you should do it. Do what you love, don't get discouraged, and just enjoy the time you have with these wonderful people. Realize how lucky we are, and be in the moment and enjoy it while it lasts. Um, I'll obviously come back and see you all. You can't get rid of me that easily. I'd like to say to everyone goodbye, and thank you for all the opportunities and friendships I've made. I love all of you. I am an Admiral player. 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 The first one I would say is when I got Oh, hi. Casey Bryant here, editor of the cast video. 
You know, when I first took on the project of the cast video, all I could think to myself was, how am I going to make this funny? People are going to be expecting some comedy in there. They're, they're not going to want to be all serious. I kept worrying, you know, oh my god, I'm going to have to write some sketches, I'm going to have to make it funny, what if they don't like it? But then, you guys selflessly stepped to the plate and said, no, Casey, we will mess up for your entertainment. We will provide you with outtakes. And all my prayers were answered. So, I want you to sit back and enjoy the best of our Admiral Player Seniors messing things up. And if you think I'm not setting it to yakety sacks, well, <laughs> your faith in me kind of disappoints me. I'm going to read you that question. <laughs> <laughs> Did you get my good side? Do you have any parting words, words of wisdom, anything like that? Be quiet when people ask you to be quiet. No, I'm kidding, I'm really kidding. Um, what does it mean to you to be an Admiral player? It means gaining knowledge and... Sorry. <laughs> I can't do this, I'm all like What does it mean to you to be an Admiral player? Um, I guess it means a lot. I'm really... Sorry, what's the question? <laughs> <laughs> what will you miss most about it? I thought we were doing the party wars question. I'm gonna cry. <laughs> to cry. <laughs> okay, go. <laughs> it means gaining knowledge and improving in dancing and singing and acting. That didn't sound robotic at all. Do you have a favorite moment as an admiral player? I have two, actually. Uh, one that's funny uh, was from Millie, and Nick and Erica and a couple other people were on stage, and over the announcements, some woman said, if you lost the sombrero, please come to the main office, and Nick just ran off stage, and uh, it was really funny. Oh, uh, Okay. What will you miss most about it? <sighs> Definitely, I would say I would miss Casey Bryant. Ah! I don't know. I want to watch their video. Hey, hey, Casey. Hey, Casey. And Bradley Levine. I feel like I'm getting interrogated on the Law and Order recipe right now. Maybe my sister. Maybe. <laughs> it's going to take a while, Casey. Okay. You love it, you should do it. No matter, it doesn't matter if your mom, your dad, teachers, pet, unless it's a bad thing, don't do bad things. What will you miss most about it? Having something to do after school because I hate the people on my bus. That's what it is! <laughs> Stop uh, laughing at me! <laughs> do you have any parting words? to future club members or just in general? I am an Admiral player. That's it? <laughs> no! That was your one and only chance at it! Did that ruin the shot? Or are you still filming? I don't know what to do, hold on, don't point to me yet. I am a drug addict. And I'm not afraid to admit it. <laughs> Our <Sorry>. president, everyone! <laughs> I don't know what to do! Seriously, what should I do? My Either my freshman or sophomore year, I remember one of the prior cast videos, Nick Salempi said, Cough. Get money. And I laughed harder than I have in anything. You're probably going to have to censor that out, but that's definitely going in. What I'll miss most is the opportunity to grow and learn as, um, as an actress because I definitely wasn't... I think... I think what I'll miss the most is a... Oh my... Cough! God! I think what I'll miss most... Um, Ask the question again. You're not stopping the camera! Okay. Amy LaCroix, <laughs> please dial 1302. Amy LaCroix, please dial 1302. Rude. Beautiful, weren't they? You know, on a more serious note, I speak for all of my fellow Admiral Player seniors when I say we want to thank each and every one of our fellow Admiral Players as well as the directorial staff. Grace, Ms. Combs, Ms. Doherty, Mr. Stevens, Mr. Sweats, everyone who works so tirelessly to put these productions together. So, I want to thank each and every one of you. We all do. And now, 
just to say goodbye. Here's all of our Admiral Player seniors. One last time. Another turning point, a fork stuck in the road. Time grabs you by the wrist, directs you where to go. So make the best of this test and don't ask why. It's not a question, but a lesson learned in time. It's something unpredictable, but in the end is right. I hope you had the time of your life. Something unpredictable, but in the end it's right. I hope you had the time of your life. It's something unpredictable, but in the end it's right. I hope you had the time of your life.